Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you for a track review, like I said I was going to do. And this is for Evanescence's new song, uh, The Game Is Over, that I just got done listening to. So I'm going to discuss what I listened to for this track, and let you know my thoughts on it. So let's dive into this review. Now I actually got to hear it twice, and what did I think of it? I think it's better than the Wasted On You track, for sure. Um, I think they took a step up and brought back some old open door vibes and uh, some kind of fallen vibes. I don't know for sure. I still have to go into uh, Evanescence discography to listen to what I'm... To what might interest me or whatever but because I never heard a lot of Evanescence albums I've heard s some songs from each album but I gotta definitely listen to some Evanescence albums for sure I'll probably do a marathon review for that probably in August or whenever I can but what did I think of this track it was really good it was pretty damn good. Um, I was not disappointed with Amy Lee's vocals in this uh, song. Uh, it did bring back a lot of vibes from their previous albums. So, like, it tried... I know I heard Everybody's Fool and Bring Me to Life. I heard that track, too. But... Those weren't terrible songs. I really liked them. Um, there's others that I probably have heard, but um, yeah, they made a compila compilation album, Synthesis, like a few years ago. Their new album's gonna be called The Bitter Truth, which that probably will be out um, sometime this year. I don't know when. Uh, it's probably going to be in the fall of this year, because I haven't seen an announcement for the album's release yet. Hopefully, the album comes out soon. Sorry, I almost yawned for a second. I, well, I kind of did. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm really excited to hear what this album's going to sound like, and... I definitely liked Amy Lee's vocals in this song. It was really good. Uh, the guitar work was great, so was the drum work. And the lyrics, like, were so amazing. They wouldn't say they resonated with me, but uh, I just liked the lyrics mostly. <laughs> That's pretty much what I'm trying to say. But out of five, I'm going to give this five out of five. I think this is a better single than Wasted On You. Wasted On You wasn't bad. I've grown accustomed to listening to it. Well, it's grown on me a little more, but I wouldn't say it's the better single. I think this one is the better single. Sorry, had a yawn spur for a second. <laughs> That's what I'm calling it, yawn spurs. Which spur, I don't think is a word, but like I have yawning moments that I try to hold it. That's why I'm calling it a yawn spur. Uh, but yeah, it's such a killer track. I did not hate this song. Sorry that I paused for a moment. I was trying to think of what to say <laughs> but yeah I definitely recommend you guys listen to this track because it's really good it came out like at midnight last night but I was surprised that they were releasing a track I thought it was gonna come out on Friday until I found the song on YouTube for the audio version for it they're gonna make a music video for it so I'll definitely review that but definitely comment below. Let me know what you guys thought of the new Evanescence track, The Game Is Over, if you've heard it. 
And if you like this track review, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can. Support the channel. I will be returning to you uh, for some new videos tomorrow. I may do Devil Driver's new single review, but I'm not sure. Uh, I know they got a new single coming out. Well, the song is out now, but I don't know if uh, I'll review it or not. But I'll let you guys know if I decide to. But yeah, sorry if I'm getting dinging. I'm sorry that you're hearing the dings. It's from my messenger. It's on my messenger uh, thing or whatever. But <clears throat> tomorrow I probably will be doing Barry Tomorrow's Cannibal album review. If not tomorrow, it's going to be Friday. And I'll be reviewing Hamilton this weekend. Probably going to be Sunday is when I'll review it. And yeah. That, and then I'll be doing a recap video on the 13th for the throwback movie reviews season 2 recap video. And I will be starting the Day to Remember album reviews possibly next week it's probably going to be next week for sure uh the marathon album reviews for day to remember because i definitely want to check their music their albums out and see what i think of them so i'm going to start with the first album all the way to the newest album which is bad vibrations but i hope you enjoyed this uh, track review I did the best I could to make it as good as possible so I hope you did enjoy it uh definitely stay safe out there take care and I'll see you in my next video